Good morning, everyone. I am cooking us some breakfast. Got some eggs going here. Yeah. Uh, bacon and egg sandwich. That's what I'm making. Yeah. How's everyone? I'm trying my new tripod out here. Be patient with me. <laughs> Yeah, so I get the hang of it. Hope everyone's doing well on this beautiful Tuesday. At least it's not raining. I never thought it was going to stop raining. You guys get lots of rain? We did. Yeah. I got lots of things to do in the kitchen today, so I thought, well, I'll bring my friends with me. Bring them along. <laughs> Yeah. Hope you don't mind coming along in the kitchen with me today. It's always a joy to have you come along. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah, we have some things to do in the kitchen today. So Michelle's going to bring her friends along. Just a simple bacon and egg sandwich today. I don't have no tomato or anything. <laughs> Almost lost that one. <laughs> okay. Okay. I got my Weight Watchers bread here. Bruce has his regular bread. Some, I had a few pieces of bacon to cook up, so. I was like, bacon and egg sandwich it is this morning. Mm hmm. There we go. There we go. Bacon, egg, and cheese sandwich and some cranberry juice. Good morning, you all. I'll be back. I got some editing to do and we'll be back in the kitchen soon. You hear them? They see me. They see me and know I'm getting them some food. <laughs> That's coming, birdies. Swans. <laughs> we got some big logs for the fire. This is all the township's going to uh, take this and would make wood chips out of it and Bruce is going to ask him if he can have the wood chips <laughs> for the gardens that keeps the weeds away yes we should see the wood we have now by our fireplace okay guys I ordered Sandy and Coco their own bed doggy bed they do their doggy beds need to be, re be replaced so I really like the round ones and the high ones that Schnauzer mom has for her dogs. And so I asked her if I, where I could get them and she showed me on Amazon. But the size that, I think I need, the standard size is good for Coco. But I'm not sure if it's good enough for Sandy. So I wanted to order oh, Sandy a bigger one. And uh. The jumbo one and they were out of it out of stock so I seen it on another I googled it well I went on Amazon and uh, I looked for a jump a bigger one and I found one I hope it's just as good as Coco's here but Coco you're your new bed king but uh Sandy's bed isn't coming till March 3rd I think it is 
Yeah. Maybe Sandy's will like this one. I don't know. We'll see. But it seems a little small for Sandy, the size. Coco's looking at me. Your bed came, Coke! <laughs> it's supposed to uh, pop up when you open it. Hang on. Let's see what we got here. They need a new bed. They're, they're old and stinky and I wash them, but they're pretty flat. <laughs> okay. Oh, Coco's going to like this. Sandy would like this, too. So it seems a bit small for Sandy. But it seems perfect for Coco. Let me try it out. Coco! Okay. I think he's a little squished in it. When I put it in his his stroller, so I'm gonna put it on the floor, see what it's like. Okay, guys, so it's a use it up kind of day. So I had this frozen pizza from takeout uh, they got. I think it last week when the when the power was out. So I'm gonna put this in Bruce's lunch. He will he will like that. <laughs> So we got a pizza. Do you ever have the too much pizza you ordered? You can always throw it in the freezer for another day. And this is perfect. So here's the lunch. Okay, we got this. Okay, I have this fruit roll up. Just the last one hanging around in the pantry. And I have some celery sticks I can give him. Celery sticks go good with pizza. And it's saying hello, everyone. <laughs> okay, I have a straw, a jar of strawberries to put in this lunch. some celery sticks too with a, a couple of those chicken egg rolls for my lunch. Okay. Make sure that lid's on. Uh, where's the lid? Okay. So he's got that, that, and then a bag of sun chips. Bruce's lunch for work today. Okay, this is my lunch. I'm going to go have lunch and then we're going to get... Morning. You had lunch. Where? Uh, get busy Prove uh, it. using up these leftovers. Yeah, we got a lot. Okay. Every time I sit down and when I, I found this new YouTube channel, I just love it. I've been watching all of their vlogs. And every time I sit down, it's so hard for me to get back up. <laughs> <coughs> after watching 
if you want to check her channel out, it's called Little Mountain Ranch. And it's in Canada, Beastie, Canada. She, they live. And uh, she has a huge family. But she don't show her kids at, hardly at all. Because, you know, you know, sickos on the internet, they like to take snaps of your kids and use them in their porn sites. So, she does not uh, have her kids in the vlogs. Maybe once in a while you'll see one here or there, but... Uh, but she does home cooking, and she she uh, does gardening, and she does a lot of canning, and she does she. I got a lot of ideas to make cough drops from her. Like you can make cough drops with just honey and lemon juice, you know. And she, I got a lot of ideas from her. If you like that kind of style of a vlog, I think you'll enjoy her. I've been watching her cooking. She cooks, you know. Um, well, it's quite a, everything homemade. She makes everything homemade and I, I just love to watch her and I love, love, love how she grows things and, uh, can learn a lot. So Little Mountain Ranch, I'm going to try and remember to leave the link in the comments. Um, because if I'm on the phone, how do I, how do I find the description below? I can't. <laughs> if I if I if I'm on my phone and I watch a video, I can't find no description below. Only when I watch it on my computer. Anyways, if you're like a ho really into homesteading and like home cooking and stuff, you can you'll enjoy her. Oh, and farm animals they got they got farm animals too. Yeah. <laughs> so if you want, go check them out. See if you enjoy them. I am now going to make a blueberry pie filling. I had these in my freezer and for a long time. Then I have them in my fridge forever. I'm making pill, uh, uh, blueberry pie filling. I have these Pillsbury dough croissants. I'm going to make Bruce. I have two of these. I'm going to use these to make... Um, Bruce blueberry turn turnovers and then if I don't know how much I have left we'll see maybe make a pie on the weekend if I have left whatever I have left or blueberry muffins I'm using it up it's a use up use up use up kind of day <laughs> so let's get started here I'm gonna probably double double this uh, recipe I have for blueberry pie filling okay so I'm probably gonna make these blueberry turnovers and then muffins because I'm not gonna have enough left for pie so so you need two cups of blueberries Yeah, I'm going to have to uh, make something small with the leftover blueberries. Two cups of blueberries. We got these in the summer. Do you remember when we went on a little trip, road trip, with our friends? Then one quarter cup of water, but I think I'm going to use this juice. Where's quarter cup? Where's quarter cup? Oh, there it is. Okay. Because this will work, right? Close enough. Okay, we're just going to put this on and we're going to stir it until the blueberries start to condense down a bit. I'll need a better spoon for that. We got a few blueberries to make 
maybe uh, blueberry pancakes or muffins. Yeah, got a few left to go. Put them over here. Okay, I'll be back after this cooks down for a bit. Then we'll add the rest of the ingredients. Okay, just boiling this up for a few minutes. I'm going to add one third cup of sugar. One tablespoon of lemon juice. Just going to let this boil for a few more minutes, and I'm going to add. I just got a little tablespoon of water here and a little bit of cornstarch. We'll add that in a few minutes to make it thick. Okay, let's add this cornstarch. So thicken it up. And turn it off because I don't want it to burn. It's got a good little heat to it already. So see it thickened right up. See that? Oh, my spoon's melting. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> forgot I had a plastic spoon. Oh, that's not good. That's okay. I'm going to remove this from the heat and let it cool down before we make our turnovers. Okay. I saved you from watching me open that Pillsbury dough crust <laughs> croissant. Okay, so basically I know they're going to leak. I have a feeling. I'm going to put the feeling in the one side. If you know me, I always uh, overload everything. So... I don't know. And then I'm going to put this on top. And I'm going to push them together. Hopefully I can cause them to stick together. We'll see. I think I overloaded it too much, but I'm not going to worry about it. If it comes out a hot mess, it comes out a hot mess. So then I'm going to put them on my pan. If they do work out, I'm going to uh, put some icing sugar drizzled, drizzled on top and some sugar if they work out. I don't know, Michelle. I gotta put less, I think. I don't know. We'll see. I'm gonna go get these all together and I will be back when they come out of the oven. <laughs> Well, I'm waiting for my blueberry turnovers to come out of the oven to have a little snack. I really don't think I like this dip. This one here is the Nacho Queso Supreme. I don't think I like that. I don't like, I'm not big on queso. Uh-oh. Mm -mm, no, I don't like that dip. 
Okay. I'm surprised. My turnovers stayed together and they didn't leak all over. <laughs> I'm gonna go do the four other ones. I got another can, so I'll do four more. Let them cool. And I'm going to put some icing dribbled on top. Wow, I'm surprised they come out this good. I was really thinking they were going to disappoint me. Okay, guys. So I made a little bit of rice, but I had shrimp from yesterday left over. So I had also a little bit of broccolini left over. And I had a garlic uh, sauce in the pantry. So I just threw that together to... Um, make use the leftovers so i have rice and i have chicken a uh, honey garlic chicken <laughs> you know what do what you can with what you got if you uh if you want to get rid of your leftovers don't throw them away create something new or eat them eat them up zen's got his rice there the dogs had some rice yeah so I'm going to let you go because I got to charge my phone up and I got a little mess here to clean after I eat. So use what you got in your fridge and create new dishes. Good night, everyone.